Hi, Capricorn. Let's look at what they aren't telling you. This is for August 23rd through September 22nd. Everything you need to know about this reading is in the description box below, as well as the recommend a reader shout out, which goes to Scarlet Moon Tarot. Much love and support to him, and hopefully you get a chance to stop by. Check him out, give him a listen, show him some love and support if you like what he has to say. This is intended for a romantic love reading. It could resonate in other areas of your life, such as friends, family, uh, work, etc., etc. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Capricorn. There we go. What are they not telling you, Capricorn? For Capricorn, what they aren't telling Capricorn. Okay. So we got nine of pentacles here, six of cups, four of cups, ten of pentacles, page of cups, sun, high priestess, nine of cups. All right, so it could be dealing with a Leo or a Pisces or a Cancerian. Doesn't have to be, just if we're looking at Major Arcana, that's who they represent. All right, so is this someone that, all right, you know what? I'm going to get into the, because I go down this, there's sometimes it's a circuitous route. <laughs> On its face, it feels like there's some disappointment that things um, have not worked out. And that someone is wanting to give time for things to work out give give something space but it's almost that um they it's not like that's going to diminish their feelings for you all right let me let me get into it here what's this six of cups it's this six of cups all right what's this four of cups Justice. What's this page of cups? This could be Libra. What's this page of cups? Six of swords. What's this sun card about? It's looking like someone's needing to take some time to um, figure out their life, to sort their life. Someone's needing some space to be able to sort their life. They're, it's not that they want it to be this way, but it needs to be this way right now. It could, it could look like someone's kind of... Um, hmm. All right, hold on a minute. What's this? This could be Pisces or Cancerian. What's this High Priestess about? Six of Cups twice. Confirm. What's this Nine of Cups about? Page of Wands. Interesting. All right, what's this Ten of Sorry, hang, give me a minute. What's this Ten of Pentacles about? This is someone that's wanting to figure out and understand. They could be saying, you know what, I just need, um, I'm going to keep my involvement with you at a minimum. I don't want it to, but what they're not telling you is that they don't want it to be this way, but they, they're, they've got some stuff going on that they need to figure out, to sort, to understand, to, there's a lot going on for them. And they might be telling you that, you know what, I just need some time to get past this tough spot for me. I just need... You know, my involvement with you is going to be kind of uh, because I've got to focus on this other area of my life, but it's quite heavy duty for them. Um, and they've got so much going on that they don't know 
how they feel about anything. They don't know what to concentrate on first. And, oh dear, pardon me, something just fell here. Let me find it. Yeah, this is someone that, the only thing I feel like they're not telling you is that they just, they're needing good in their life. They just, they can't handle any more complication in their life. This is someone that want, really needs some time to sort out their business. Um, it could be that there's kids involved here. We've got, you know, six of cups and a couple of pages here. This is someone that's really needing to focus on the care for their kid or kids um, and that might take them away that might be their main focus and yet there's so much else going on that they're like okay what do I how do I um, or it could be that this is an inner child issue if you go along with that thinking that someone's really got to sort out some things from their past they really need to connect with their intuition and their divinity and connect to source and try to heal and sort out and figure out how um, how they're going to resolve some past issues. So this isn't really, this is almost like this person telling you, I'm sorry, but I can't be with you right now. I got to sort my business. I got to figure this crap out. I'm not happy about it, but it has to be this way right now. I have to, to figure out my stuff because I can't keep living this way. I've got to find my happy because I'm not and I'm confused and I'm overwhelmed and I need some clarity and I've got to start I think they want things to be very simple. I think they want to get over this hump. They want to move past all this crap and they want things to be very simple. It could be that they're going to ask you to wait for them. I don't know that they want to put that on you though. I think they're just looking for their life to be simplified and they're going to try and sort this business out. So I don't think they're deceiving you. I think they're just not telling you all that is going on for them. I think I don't think they want to burden you, Capricorn. And I feel like they also... Um, they just need space. And it's not because of you. It's a, this whole other world that maybe they've not told you about. But there's a whole heck of a lot going on that they need to sort out that doesn't have anything to do with you. So they, it's like they're dealing with something from their past or they're having to take care of kids. It's one of those two things. Or both. I mean, that, why not? Let's throw both of them in the mix. What's this Ten of Pentacles about? I mean, let's not throw them, but you know what I mean. The, the whole shebang, really. What's this Ten of Pentacles about? There's, there it is. This is that past coming back up. What's this Ten of Pentacles about? Yeah. So your job, what you need to do for yourself, this is, I mean, look at that. There's the Nine of Pentacles right there. This is all about you maintaining that stability and security for yourself. And not crossing the line when it comes to devaluing yourself just to keep connection with somebody. And I honestly, to be fair, they don't want you to do that either. This is not someone that's looking to game you. This is someone that can't give you any more than they've already given you right now. They can't. They simply can't. They're, it's not just kids. It's not just their past. They've got life coming at them from all sides right now, and they really need some stability and solace. And they are not telling you the magnitude of the crap flying around, but that's the only thing they're not being upfront with you about. They're not trying to be deceptive. They just need space. Um, you might be thinking that there's deception. There's not. But there is um, a lot more that's unclear than is clear. So this is not really a stable connection. And um, only because of that. It's not that it's this... It's not that this is volatile, it's just simply not, it's not going to be a, a constant for you because this person doesn't have room for it in their life. There's something very taxing um, that is going on that they need to attend to. So there's just, it's just a lot going on. Um, we got the moon here and this could be Libra. We got Libra twice here. This is Queen of Swords. And then we got the moon here, Pisces or Cancerian. So... You know, when it comes to stability of a home here, that this is you taking care of things on your own by yourself while your person works out their business because there's simply just too much uncertainty that you're having to stay. You, you cannot get mired down by this. You can't do it. They don't want you to, 
but um, this is about you needing to be decisive and direct and managing your own life by yourself. It's like this should be right here. This should be you right here. It is not for you to get involved. You, you're not, not because they don't care and not because you don't care, but you can't. You don't have any place in their business right now. They're needing to sort things out and wade through and figure things out. And they need to come to stability and happiness and at peace on their own. And that is something they have to figure out. They don't want to bother you with it for one thing, but it's, it's simply too big for anybody else in their life to handle. And, and I, I don't mean that like, oh my God, it's a complete dumpster fire. No, but this is someone that really does want to walk the journey by themselves. They don't want to be rescued. It's a, it, it feels like it's a very private thing for them. There's just a lot to sort out and they don't need the distraction or the burden of somebody else being along with them. Not to say that you're a burden, um, but they really, I mean, you know. What else for Capricorn? What else for Capricorn? The thing is, there's still, they, they still, it's not that they don't care, but they can't give any more than they have been right now. And they need, they don't need distance from you. They need to move past the turmoil in their life and they need solace and solitude and privacy to be able to do that. So it's not that they wanna move on from you, it's that they can't attend to you right now. They have to get through their business. That was for Capricorn. I feel like it should be both of them. Okay, yeah. We got Earth and Transformation. So this is someone that is trying to find some balance trying to find solace, trying to find some groundedness, is really attempting at transforming their life, they're, they sense that they need a change, that, they, that there's stuff that needs to get sorted out, and they're really wanting to be able to do that. That's pretty darn brave, honestly. Most people, it's that's hard. <laughs> could be dealing with an earth sign. Um, could be dealing with Scorpio, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. But this is just someone that needs to sort their business and they know they need to do it. They're not shirking away from it. It's just a lot for them right now. Right. What else for Capricorn? What else for Capricorn? What else for Capricorn? The hermit. Yep. So it's, it's almost like both of you are in your separate corners, but not because you don't care, but because it, ha it simply has to be that way right now. Someone is doing some figuring out of their life. Someone is doing some much needed in taking inventory and really wanting to understand their life. They're almost done, but it's been a definite journey. There's transformation involved. You're like, this is someone that's really going through it right now. In a good way, but still just going through it. What else for Capricorn? What else for Capricorn? The thing that, I, okay, it's not that I like it, but the thing that, about this that I like, this feels pure. It feels like someone is not doing any kind of deceptive shenanigans, even though we got the moon card here, this is someone that just really is wanting um, to cut through all the BS for themselves. Like their intent is pure here. So it's not someone that's being shady or shifty. What they're not telling you is simply because either they don't know it yet or they don't want to burden. They're, you know, in flux, so they can't really explain it from one day to the next, but it's pure. What else for camera? So we got the nine of wands. No, we don't. Do we? Ten of wands. That's the ten of wands. And we got the king of cups. So this could be Pisces. And this could be, uh, well, ten of wands is ten of wands. So this is someone that is really trying to wade through all that is going on in their life right now. And they're trying to keep balance emotionally they're really looking for that balance and that peace and that calm so that they can start to move forward in the other areas of their life 
So this is someone that's just wanting to find, I don't want to say the end, but it's just, is really been working hard at trying to figure things out in their life, trying to find that balance, that peace, that contentment so that you and they, they can eventually proceed. You are on hold right now as far as they're concerned. They just, there's, I don't know what the heck, God bless them. I mean, honestly, just because it's huge. And they're, they're going at it full force. They're showing up. But that's what mainly they're showing up for. The rest, the areas of their life, that's, um, everything else is kind of on the back burner except for the pure essentials because this, whatever this is, is huge for them. And they really are doing their due diligence to try and get through it. So my hat's off to them. It takes a special kind of bravery to do that crap. It's not easy. All right. Capricorn, I hope this was helpful. Um, I wish your person peace and safe passage. Whew. I thank you for stopping by. And I hope to see you in the next reading. You take care.